What's up YouTube? This is Demkeys back again with another Unity tutorial. Now many of you must have faced this problem where you have used transform.translate to move your object. But when the object collides with something there's a strange vibration in it. Like okay it's collided and the object cannot go through it. Fine that's good. But if you continue trying to move in that direction it's going to vibrate. The object will vibrate and it will partially go through the object that it's colliding with. Uh, let me show you what I mean. Okay. I have already created a background, a ground, two boxes and our player. The boxes and the player have box collider 2D components and rigid body 2D components. However, the box, uh, both the boxes, uh, they have is kin is kinematic checked so that they don't move when our player collides with them. What what are the detail am I missing? Yeah, and I've created three materials: one for the background, one for the ground, and one for our player and two boxes. Now. I'm going to create a script for our player. We'll call this a move script. Okay. Now I'm going to create a move speed variable. Um, it's a float type variable and it's public so that I can change the value from the inspector panel. Now I'm going to get the direction in which our player is supposed to move. And multiply that with move speed. Now I'm going to use transform.translate to move our player. Okay, so you can see the movement is fine. It hits, the player hits this object and does stop. That's good. But notice this weird vibration. As I continue trying to go in that direction, after the collision has happened, there's a weird vibration. Now the vibration will continue as long as I keep my finger on the key and keep trying to move in that direction. Now I looked this up on YouTube, no sorry, on on uh, Google, but I did not find many useful answers, mostly because I wasn't sure what to Google. Uh, but what I did find was, actually what I found was, it was enough, it was uh, more than enough. Uh, one person on uh, the Unity forums, he explained this as he explained transform.translate as sort of a teleportation. You are teleporting the object from one place to another. And instead of that, you can try using add force, rigid body 2D dot add force. This weird thing happens because you're trying to move the object to a different location. It cannot move to that location because of the collision that's happening. However, the, the behavior is different, well, not different as in it won't collide, it will collide, it's just the vibration won't be there. The, the behavior is different in that way when you use rigid body 2D dot add force. Now you have seen this behavior in transform.translate. Now watch what happens when I use rigid body 2D dot add force. Oh, just a minute. I will need to create an F condition.
and okay this is for moving right and this will be for moving left I'll just change the vector to dot right to negative so it will move in the opposite direction oh I also need to change this because now that we are applying force 0 0.2 is just not enough I think 20 should be fine yep 20 is fine see what happens when when both the objects collide now bear in mind I do have my finger on the key so I'm still trying to go through the object but that's it it has just stopped over there the force is still being applied but nothing is gonna happen now I don't know if my explanation about this was good enough or not I'm pretty sure it wasn't you can find a better explanation on Google if you try I tried but I was I wasn't sure what to what to Google so I got one or two useful answers so anyways uh, this is how you solve the problem I hope this this video was useful don't forget to like share and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time